Hello, people of the internet, and welcome to a rare Sunday stream. Thank you for that intro, Lunar. Um, I didn't get, well, I, play, I did get a little bit of time to play this yesterday morning, uh, and then my day was filled with other things. But today, I'm getting home late from an outing with some family, and I can't wait until tomorrow to play, so we will be playing more of it tonight, and hopefully maybe streaming some tomorrow night, maybe? I, I don't know. I just, I really want to get back to playing more of this, so that's what we're going to do tonight. And um, I'll show you a little bit of what I've done yesterday. I only played for like two hours maybe yesterday, but uh, we did a little bit of, a little bit of something, but... It's been playing for hours and I haven't made any progress. Yeah, exactly. What's up, Crisp? Um, so, yeah, basically kind of the same thing. I, like I said, I only played for a couple hours yesterday. I didn't progress like any. Of course, I didn't do any side quests like doing all of those on stream. Uh, but I did go around, did, did some fights, did some searching and stuff. Um, but just to kind of kind of like what I did with Breath of the Wild. I'll just kind of quick show off a little bit of kind of what I came across. Came across a golden apple, which is new to this game, unless I just totally didn't see it. Um, there are new flying enemies, Aracudas. So I got an Aracuda wing and an eyeball, and I found an energetic rhino beetle. Uh, and then I did go to the sky for the three islands that are in this little area, and they all just had, I think, two of them had large zonite, and one of them was like one of the orbs or whatever. Uh, Moblin Horns, Rugged Rhino Beetle, basically all the new stuff that I, that I found. Um, as far as on the map, like I said, I went to these three, um, sky things here, uh, and they just had more, just resources and stuff. Still can't get to this one yet. Don't know what that is all about. So I went to all three of those, and there wasn't anything super special. I did go around and find, um, found some shrines and stuff. I came across upon a big guy over here which i died to but i do want to kind of go back there but there's some shrines here all around that i want to do and then i marked the map with some uh some things that i want to see so i tried to not really do much yesterday in my two hours but i got some of it done but let's get to it and um we'll figure out uh what it all is the star islands are too high to reach and i've tried everything short yeah uh, I'm guessing, yeah, I'm guessing it has to do with story progress because they don't have a, um, thing that falls down for you. Uh, and it's, I mean, it's way, way, way up there. Like, you can barely see it whenever you can see it. I don't, I don't know. Over that way, right? Over that way. Way up. But anyways. All right, so let's, uh, let's do this. I want to get some stuff done. Um, I want to first check out over here, seeing as we're close to this. I marked it on the map. So I'm going to, I have stuff written down on how I'm going to mark things just for myself. Um, so like if it's a crystal, it means it's like a cave. If it's a skull, kind of like what we did with Breath of the Wild. Uh, if it's a skull, it's like a big, like um, either a rock monster or a big pig monster, or whatever it is. Star means... Um, I've completed it or whatever. I mean, there's really no completing this. This is just like a base, but just so I know, hey, I've kind of gone through this. Uh, the person markers here are people that I think have side quests to do. Um, so here's a cave there. Uh, and I do like how some of them actually have uh, caves on them, and it has a check mark, which is nice. And then there's that well we went to. Uh, and then there's this big guy over here, and then some shrines and whatnot. Um, let's do this thing as we're right here. Let's just do it. Uh, I gotta go around and get on top of the thing, but, but how are y'all doing? What's up, Barto? How are you? Welcome in. Have you tried reusing the towers? Uh, no, I haven't yet. We did the one on Friday night, and I have not reused it. But there are definitely more I would like to do. I'm not sure how I'm gonna get how much I'm gonna get done tonight. I hopefully can do about three hours maybe for what is it a little after eight so stop it okay um so yeah i don't know i don't know how much i'm gonna get done but i want to i want to play <laughs> i may lose a little sleep but oh well 
We'll see what happens. But this was pretty cool. I think I don't remember if this was in the last game or not. Oh, excuse me. If this big tree was in the last game, I remember there being a big tree. And then you built like a town around it or something. Um, so I don't remember, but then I went up to this and I looked down and there's a big area down here. So I'm going to go check it out. We will check it. Discovery injured tree stump. Oh, well, we can go get some of this stuff. Whatever this is. Bright cap. There's bright cap all around. Ooh, one of those things. Oh, it's one of the uh, tech tights or whatever. All right, we'll do that in a minute. That thing was really gross. Oh, no, don't hit me off. Oh. Just stop, okay. Stop it. All right, and I did do some more, like, fusing and stuff. Can't remember what I had, but... I, I found that the Macoblin or the Bocoblin arms already give you 20. So adding stuff to that, using stuff to it's an extra little bonus. So those Bocoblin arms are pretty crazy. 20 attack. No, that's kind of nuts. At least for right now in this early in the game. Who knows how crazy it gets. But it's great for scouting out shrines. Terrytown, which... Is in Akala on the top right. Yeah, that would be a good way to find shrines because it looks like they're lit up definitely more than they were last game, maybe, or a little easier to find, perhaps. But we'll see. I don't know if I want to try to kill this thing or not. It's going to be tough when it's at an angle like this. I don't know. I may just, I may leave that guy. May just leave him. We'll see. Who's back here? Oh, geez. I don't have the game volume up. Nobody said anything. But I understand the arms will break while fused, while most items will break the fusion before breaking unless they oh so they so they're powerful but they're less durable is kind of like what you're saying all right that's what it is i'll just kill whatever with it and then just pick up whatever they were using so does this have a it does have a little mark by it okay i'm gonna get rid of this delete the stamp and it's got a little thing by it Yeah, okay. Well, that makes sense. They're bone. Seems like they would be a little brittle. Yeah, I just don't like... I don't know. We'll see if I can fight this thing. But I still haven't <laughs> learned a quick way of killing the ectites. But it seems like the stuff they drop is... Oh, one of these dudes. How am I going to get this dude with the rabbit? What? I was going to say the rabbit's not going to... Rabbit's not going to be able to give me anything. Bub... Bubble, bubble gem, bubble, 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 bubble gem. All right, so that's really probably the only thing that needs to be checkmarked. Okay, so we can see what else is down here. Well, I'm, I might try to take out this tech tight. We'll see. Gotta get somewhere before I sink. An NPC told me every cave has a glowy frog. Okay, well, that makes sense. That, uh, that they'd maybe do that that way. That's good. Ooh, wait, there's something over here. I don't have everything found yet. More goodies. 
If I cook up some of these glowy fish, what they'll do? Oh wait, what is it? Doesn't say you'll glow. I think I made I made a whole bunch of um, of stuff too. Um, yeah, I made a whole bunch of bunch of foods. If I remember correct. I went through and I made a whole bunch of uh, recipes. So there's a whole bunch of stuff here. But this, I made a fish skewer with the glowing fish. Um, right here and it gives me four hearts and it adds a glow effect which is kind of cool so if you're in a cave and you don't want to use your arrows i'm guessing it gives you like a, a glow around you that uh that's pretty cool pretty pretty cool all right so really nothing else here except for the tectite which i'll go ahead and try to oh they give me a palm flower which is good way to kill this guy. A three. Kinda want to do. Does that give me back my bomb? Oh, it does. Okay. I don't want to hit him. I'm like open up. Him with the bomb, and that did nothing. Right, I'll stick with the fire. Oh, shoot. oh crap! Go 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 go! Maybe just because I was so weak the first time we fought one. Yeah, well, I'm definitely getting rid of... I don't need the flame emitter shield. That's pretty cool. I did also see on Instagram something cool you can do with the shields, which I want to go do here in a minute. Um, but it's funny how the... Uh, the map shows that, you know, you have a check mark, but that just means you got the frog, which is good. Good way to track whatever those things are going to do. But I also would like to know that I got everything in the cave, but I guess that's up to me to remember to do so. Uh, you can also throw the materials the same way you do. Yeah, I remember it teaching me. Oops, sorry, hit the mic. It teaching me that. Um, how is the sound? Okay. Um, where you do R... And as you're holding R, you press up. I can do that and throw one as well. I don't think it gets as much of an effect as it using a arrow, maybe, but... So cool. I always get to use this. Oh. Didn't go up, up. All right, I gotta go up again. I'm glad there's no, like, cooldown for some... For that, you know. Ooh, ooh, nice. I'll put that bomb flower back. Like if I just use it, boom! I can just, you know, use it again. Oh wow, you can come up in water too. That's pretty cool. Kind of sucks. I'm kind of far away. Oh, and I'm getting hit by a freaking. What's that? Yeah, that dude. Damn it. No, actually, I do need to replenish some of my uh, stamina to get over. It's more to save your arrows in caves. You can throw the bright seeds in the wall, not waste center. Oh, that's true. I mean, I've got. Oh, I'm down to 47, so yeah, I guess maybe saving some arrows would be good. So, all right, cool. So that's the cave. 
I did get some more Korok seeds too. I want to go over to this giant forest. Um, and see what is so giant over here. See, there was a big dude sleeping or something. I also didn't really search much over here for these uh, these ruins right over this hill. I didn't really search in here at all either, so I'm going to go check this out. But yeah, save some Koroks. Got, um, how many do I got now? I'm up to 18 Korok seeds. Yeah, I did, uh, I did a little bit of, uh, did a little bit of stuff. Rusty Claymore. Actually, I want to throw that Rusty Claymore. And I want to fuse it. I'm still learning all this stuff. Fuse it with the Traveler Shield. I like that. I like that combo. I found it to be a uh, good combo. But the real one I want to do is I want to get, uh, I don't know, the sol sol soldiers. I should have probably done that with the claymore. Oh, whatever. I'll definitely go through some of this in the meantime. But there's something I want to fuse with a shield <coughs> here in a little bit. Like I said, I saw it on, um, not on Instagram. And I am kind of interested to, uh, to do it. If there's anything interesting over here at all. Oh, here's uh, another. Yeah, I want that side. I don't need a rusty shield. Oh, that broke very easily. I guess I could have just picked him up. Break him up and throw it up. Hey, what do we got? Oh, we got some chews. Come at me if you choose. Oh, they died from being in the water? Okay. I do think that there are a lot more arrows now in the game. In, like, arrows and stuff. At least from what I remember in the last game. But there's a, definitely a lot of more arrows. Shield combinations range from... Oh, what the heck? What, what just hit me? Damn it. Combination drain from borderline useless to shrine solutions. Oh, really? I like how you die, too, changes the text of the game over. I think if you died a melee attack, it's red, and I just died to electricity, so it's yellow. Yeah, lightning hit me, but from what? Was it a... I don't know what it was. I'm going to get that again, but I don't need that. Back over here, I guess. Lightning from something. Did this? Oh, it didn't. Didn't take. All right, I'll fuse. Man, I'm my brain. I can't. Okay. Fuse my. Hold on a second. Fuse my um. Shield with a barrel? That would be kind of... Yeah, it was probably a, a chew that hit me with lightning. I just wasn't paying attention. But I want to go over here and do this. Yeah, right there. Something, something hit me. Oh, no, he's up there. Maybe it was him. That was actually a better thing to, to fuse with, honestly. Yeah, I think it's this guy. Yeah, it's a Liza Floss with his arrow.
Clip. Got him. And I got Traveler's Bow. Oh, we haven't got any Lizafloss stuff yet. Shock Fruit. Okay, nice. And a Lizafloss one. Fuse Power 8? Ooh. Ooh, what's this? Um, so if I... Um... Let's do that. Let's pick up, uh... Here we go. So let's drop that. Oh, it fused it onto my arrow because I have my arrows out. Oh, frick. I didn't mean to do that. Take that off. This. And I just want to do this. Okay. Drop. Now fuse with. Oh, I don't have a regular weapon anymore. I just used it. All right, never mind. Pick that up. All right, what's what's down here? Sage Temple Cave. Ooh, there's a good amount of stuff down here. Look at all that. Am I gonna blow all that up? Let's use a bomb flower. Oh, really? I thought maybe it would just blow a whole bunch of it up. Wow, this is, um, I'm gonna have to come back for this. It's like eating away slowly at it. Oh, yeah, this is being interesting. I don't want to waste another bomb flower. Oh, shit. I don't want that. Be... Oh, okay, because it's on the bone. It's on the, yeah, that's why. You can use hammer type. Yeah, I don't have any hammer type weapon. So yeah, so that's why I have this with the Bacoblin arm and it's breaking really easily. Yeah, I see. Yeah, it makes sense. Oh, there. Why not? Uh, actually, no, I don't want that. Okay, so this is a uh, map moment that I need to come back to. So I need to mark it with the cave. Back. Pretty cool. That's just building material. There is a lot of building material that I've seen around. Which is cool, but... Ooh. He's fighting over here. Oh, he's taking care of him pretty well. I don't really need to help him. But I'll help him out anyways. Good job, buddy. What are you doing? Oh. Hello there, you traveler too. My name is Savri. I'm a wandering chef. I wander from place to place, searching caves for unique, delicious ingredients. It's supposed to seem to like mine explorers. You're welcome to use my cooking power whenever you like. Oh, and I bet there are things I learned in the cave searches could be come in handy in my journal. Cave, it's our chock full. You're traveling to the fullest, for instance. There's an opening in the ground north of here that leaves to a cave if you. Break one of the ore deposits with a hammer you can get ore, obviously, but more than that. 
And there's flint for starting fires, rock salt for cooking, yeah. Luminous stones, gems, yeah. Ah. Oh. That's a long travel. Cool. Where's his journal? He just talked about his journal. And I got, yeah, I got one of these Korok fronds. I don't know what they do yet. Seriously, it looks like it might be hiding something behind it. It has some medicinal value. Attach it to a stick and it can be used as a fan. Well, yeah. But I'm guessing maybe we use that in a cook. Let's try one. Try one out. And try cooking. But what's what's his... What's he talking about? Ah. <laughs> his journal. Or maybe he was just saying in general. Uh, yeah, let's try... Uh, let's try... Using that. Let's cook up. Uh, I had a bunch of meat. Maybe I already cooked it all. I think I probably did. Uh, let's cook a. Uh, let's do a fish and and that. See what it does. Oh, it's a Korok joke. Okay, so it really doesn't. I just have steam fish. That's fine. Korok joke. Well, I can use it for stuff. Lots of building stuff. Lots of building. Yeah, look at that. Alright. Well, oh, yeah, I was going to go to this giant forest thing. Yeah. I don't know if I'll be able to beat this guy, but... Check it out. Oh, there's a big guy sleeping. Is it a bunch of bones? Maybe I haven't been here yet. It's dead right now. Hmm. I have it marked, but I thought it had a guy. I'm guessing he comes to life somehow. Maybe at night? Well, it's not right now. It's almost midnight. Oh, no, it's in the morning. Oh, yeah, he might pop up at night like all the other stuff. All right, well, that's cool. That's fine. <clears throat> okay, got that. There's a person there. Um, I do want to go do this now before I forget. Um... Where is the nearest place that has, I think up here. Looking for a mine cart, what I'm looking for. I'll show you why. Don't know how long it'll last durability wise, but. Oh, this is inside. Alright, it's this one. Um, yeah, we'll see. We can do something. I guess I could have technically gotten to that by dropping down here, too. For a mine cart, probably be up where the rails are and stuff. Oh, did I not open this? Oh, I didn't search everything on this island, so definitely probably missed a whole bunch of stuff. 
there. Here. Hey, how about that? Yeah, now that I have the uh, parasail thing, I can easily get to other places. Yeah, this is way up. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go down. I forgot how freaking high up this is. Can I go over to that one? I don't know if I've been over there. I don't know if I can get to it. Yeah. Let's see what we got. I think this is the one I pulled out of the water. The chest out of the water in this one, I think, yeah. Definitely be mine carts over here. Right there. <clears throat> so I just want to do up here so I can go down. Ooh, that's close. Alright, so one thing I saw is you can fuse mine carts on shields. I don't know if I want to do it on that one. Let's get rid of the, uh... Get rid of the... That. Now, you can do this thing, and you have a freaking skateboard. <laughs> ah, that's so cool. And you can also do it on rails. Check that out. So cool. So freaking cool. Tony Hawk up in here. I don't know how it does durability wise. definitely using the durability up but I mean it's not like I'm using the shield though it's just whatever's on I don't know so cool all right where are we going why isn't that water going all the way down? Look at all those sky islands. All right, let's let's so figure out what I'm doing now. I got my my goodies. Let's. Uh, oh wow, I'm way out of there. Oh, let's see how far we can fly over. I don't have very much. Don't have very much. Stamina. <laughs> With and on, that's funny. Try there, there. We got some. Plus, there's that red thing in the ground that I want to check out. Oh, there's a shrine right here and a uh, stable. I'm off the map, so we're going to go check that out. Mine as well. Alright, I'm going to change my shield for now. We'll do a shrine. my huge sword with a boulder on it. It's 
Sweet. Ooh. Building with logs. Do that. I need an ultra hand. Log there. Guess like that. So I can get up it. Secret. All right, and I got that to there. Stay there. Oh, it will. So need to find the secret chest. A whole bunch of logs there. No, I don't think I'll be enough. Let's do the rest. Just to be safe. See up there though. Alright, there. Oh, it looks like it's over there. Okay. Well, I already have this. Might as well use it. Those things are pointed is the direction it goes. Oops. This may be too big. I may not be able to have it be propelled. 
Found out in a second. <clears throat> Just need to be able to at least get me close. Yo, Savage, what's up? Do I not have... Is it infinite power when I'm down here in the shrine? Does it not count my... Yeah, it doesn't... So, in a shrine, there's no battery power? Interesting. Oh. Spiky shield. It's only got two, though. Why didn't it let me switch out my shield, though? It's only weapons? Oh, shoot. <clears throat> what is this, then? An old wooden shield and just spikes. All right, well, I don't want it. I just wanted to pick it up so I could get my check mark on the shrine. There we go. How are you doing tonight, Savage? Welcome. What? Oh, it's so huge. Oh, don't shake it. What the heck? Okay, why? What's what's going on? What's going on? keep spinning I'm I'm only tapping the the direction thing At one time stop stop right there I could swim over at this point yeah so I guess in shrines they don't um they don't take away your battery nice sweet I just quit one job to hop on like quit quit or you mean like you finished your job for the day like you literally quit a job <laughs> hopefully you'll be all right man nice look at this i'm off the map i'm off the map Oh, and I've been finding rupees, too. I think I found some rupees last time, didn't I? I can't remember. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. Skateboarding down the hill. Heck, yeah. Wait, we can talk to him now and get my horse. Oh. Oh. Maybe. Either end also doubles it in. Seems like you're not a member yet. Mm -hmm. Only stable members membership if you're able to register. Ask your name. Oh. Link. All right, Mr. Link. There. You're all signed up. Um, tell me about the stable. Yeah. Oh, well, oh. I meant to say tell me, but that's okay. So I want to tell you, catch a wild horse, bring it here, register. I'm going to build a oh, no, I can help you. Um, register horse. Mm. Oh, not register. I want to take a horse. They said you can take a horse oh. out. Hmm. Did I read that wrong? Or maybe at a certain point of the game. I want to call. Oh, here we go. I want to call a horse. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. Oh. oh. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, maybe a certain point in the game it does. Oh, wait. No, my save. No, my save data is on here. Mm. Yeah, my save data is on, on here. So, I don't know what the dealio is. Oh, well. Uh, then I, when I was at, I would take three buses and still have to walk 15 minutes. Oh, man. Okay. All right. Well, hopefully it still all works out for you. Wait, what was I thinking? Explain pony points. Yeah. What is what is this? The road system, you can use the stables in short. Every time you use the service, you get points. No matter what stable you go to, you can register lodging. Now then, if you first use the Riverside, you get a pony point. Pony points card. Okay. Oh. They've enough to earn a wagon load of wonderful rewards for you and your horse companions. Mm. You can trade your pony points for prizes. The ledger over there. Check out the ledger details. Cool. Oh. 
Oh. Back again. Well, yeah, maybe. Yeah, maybe you have to. There's Beetle. Looking exactly the same as last game. Uh, read the ledger. It takes useful men for information. Points and rewards. Need two points to receive the towing harness. Remember, we can also check plenty points. Points and rewards. Okay, well, I want to see. We're staying at inns. Oh, wait, no, never mind. Mm. Two more points. Okay. So staying at the inn also gives you some. Some news. Mm. Being taken temperatures, Rito Village. Uh. Rito Village froze in this now? Oh, is that what that said? Yeah. So it's all frozen now in Rito Village. Blood Moon brings Knight's Blood Moon. Doing all right, cool. All right. All right, Beetle. Hey. What are you up? What are you up to? Beetle shape backpack. I like how they kept them having the same voice as some of the other games. Buying anything weighing you down. Gemstones in particular. Okay. Alright, so let's see what... Look what I've got first. Oh, and it's got the price right on them. Rather than having to hover over them. So I can just look. I wish I could organize it by... Price. But, okay. So, five, ten... I want to see 30 of oh, the beetles. Wow. 110 for those. Let's go ahead and sell one of those, even though those are good for arrows, but I could sell one. Uh, since I haven't updated Twitch, everything word is, oh, every word together, every single, oh, every single. Okay. You don't like the new update. I, the Twitch app I haven't used Yay. in some time. So I got a little money to work with. What's he got here? 10, 10. So nothing super crazy expensive. Basically any of these parts that have fuse power. Because you're going to get a whole bunch of them. Might as well add some extra onto your attack, you know. Basically the gems are going to be the thing I do. All right, let's see what things he sells. If it's like the first game, it's going to be arrows and then some beetles. Yeah, basically that's it. I'll go ahead and buy those. Wow! Oh, that's 120. Wow. I don't need to buy any of this stuff. I can find it as we go. So, all right. So basically, the same as the the last game. Okay. Music's the same too. Does that have anything on it? What's that? Work in progress. Do not touch. Okay. Oh, and here's a uh, a meal. Something in something is something. <laughs> I can't see what that is. <clears throat> oh, this is for the end. I don't need to stay. We'll do that later. What are you looking at? Wait to be, rest to be, rest to be. Oh, I can't wait. That's oh, so exciting. Excuse me. I was lost. In, oh, lost in thought. A group of gourmets who frequent our stable to teach me new recipes to cook. This be the session is dish dessert princess elder stuff. I'm so excited. I can't wait. Can't sit still. Okay, cool. There's a tower right there, too. I would love to do a couple towers tonight. Um, all right, let's uh, let's fast travel because at this point it would take me forever to walk. She's doing good getting. Getting used to the new life. Moved into a house. Uh, I don't know if you've been around. Back when... It's been a couple months, but... I am uh, moved into a house. Got engaged. And, uh... Yeah, she's... She's, uh... There's a bird dude. Can I go back up it? <laughs> nice. She's getting used to the uh, the life changes here. 
Okay, cool. So it does let you go back up and great thing. <laughs> Did not want to do that. When I'm falling like this. Oh, it doesn't. Oh, that's interesting. So the slow mo doesn't take your stamina away unless you shoot something. That's interesting. I can't dive. Yeah. I want to hold R to dive. Oh, R, not RL. I'm an idiot. Hello. Oh my god, that was so funny. I'll probably run in the sky. It's good to meet one. Launch from the sky tower. Historic moment. Hey, what's your name? Mm. Link, you say, hold on there. Really? Your name is Link. Hey, buddy. You've got <laughs> the same name as a famous swordsman. Well, that is me, dude. Pretty good name to live up to. I'm ah. Pen. By the way, I work for the Lex Clover set. I'm writing articles, folks. Uh, sky tower. Break it to work. <laughs> Newspaper short on wait, what'd you have left over though? The oh the rice and Oh yeah. From staff is oh, do I get to sort the mail again like in Wind Waker? Stop all over the place news. Another reporter just uh seems like a brave type and all Oh so much reading. Why don't they do voiceovers for everything? It's based on in Hebra to the northwest. You'll find it in near the bridge, the Rito village. Stop by after the adventure of lifetime and up until then. Stop by. So long, nice dude. Uh, she's eight. Uh, she is seven. And when is the wedding next April? Yeah. All right, I want to go. Oh, there was a whole bunch of stuff I wanted to do here too, actually, because there was this whole thing underground, and a couple of people I wanted to talk to. So I want to go down here first. Where did you get to? There's somebody that had a quest. Yeah, this one here. Oh. Bermano. Hey, are you new here? You may scoff, but I know a fresh face when I see one. I can... I can say that because of the newcomer too. My name is Romano. They put me up to charge cooking. I want to say fancy for today's menu. We have a fruit and a mushroom mix. That'll rev you right up. Yeah, I won't ever look forward to saying that. But I'm plumb out of apples. I've got a couple apples. And I found out my most important ingredient to say goodbye to the rich flavor. And those is detecting an aroma, a sweet, tangy, pleasant aroma. Could it be you have an apple? Yeah, I'll take this. All you need is one. Dude, apples are all over the freaking place. I'm giving you first crack at some grub. Hold on a second. Hell yeah, you have more kids? Nope. She has a son of her own. Hello? There we go. Um, and I've got mine, and that's really all we're good for. <laughs> Calling it Bermano Special Fruit and Mushroom Mix. Looks tasty, doesn't it? I like to make a big deal of it, but anyone can make it. All you need is an apple mushroom in the pot. You should try to make some. Cool. I just did a quest by giving a guy an apple. <laughs> you really saved my bacon. <laughs> okay. Oh, what's up, D-Shot? My first side quest done. And all it was was an apple. All it was. And nobody else had some side quests. I'm, I'll talk to everybody kind of in my own time, I guess. 
You guys don't want to see me talk to every single person. What? That's not fun. You want to you want to get to some fighting. You want some fighting? That's what we're gonna do. One way over there. Oh wait, is this a well? Well, well, well. Check it out. My big rock thing? Not. What the hell? That kind of sucks. Have anything else that'll blow that up? This is just fire, it's not gonna blow up anything. done for the day. I'll take that as done. What? Whenever the dampener's closed and needs to open. It's only closed a little bit, it'll buzz just as it opens, but yeah, I know, it's very annoying. Ooh. Okay, here we go. What the heck? I can't even remember what that is. What'd you type in, Savage? Can you read that? What does that say? Oh, it's a phony mo? What the heck? I can't even see what what it is. It's so small looking. Ooh. Come on, give me something good. Whoa! Okay. Alright. Goodbye, Rusty Claymore. Hello, Royal Claymore. We gotta find something... We gotta find something... Nice to fuse that with. Is it all rusted, too? It kind of. It's two-handed, but you get some sweet to fuse it with. That'll be nice. 